Hello folks, welcome back to Landmark. A uh, quick video today, really because I made a video a couple of weeks ago, Old Grey was not happy. And the reason he wasn't happy was, I tried to play uh, DC Universe online. And when I attempted to do so, I was told that my account had been migrated to ProSyben because I was in the EU. Therefore, I couldn't use my all access pass. So I promptly deleted DC Universe Online. Looked into it and found that it was true. And I couldn't make a, an account where I could use the all access. So I made a video of that saying, saying I wasn't happy about it. Right, so this morning I was about to go on EverQuest 2 and I noticed on the patch there was a link. On the link is, it said uh, there was something about ProSyben and SOE. So I clicked the link and went on and had a read. And it appears that on July the 1st, EverQuest 2, Planetside 2 and... DC Universe Online will no longer be run in the EU by ProSyben. They will revert back to SOE. So SOE will be looking after the games as they used to do. Which is excellent news. So I had a quick look at the, the fact online the fact online and It's not answered a couple of the questions that I had. Now basically, when the deal was struck with ProSyben, Landmark and EverQuest Next were part of the deal, so I'm not quite certain that with SOE taking back EverQuest to Planetside 2 and DC Universe Online, if ProSyben will still be getting Landmark, and um, of course next, I don't know. I'm sure, but I'll find out about that soon enough. In the meantime though, it would appear that after July the 1st then, my all access pass will come into effect for DC Universe Online. So I'm quite happy. It means I'll, if I want to, I'll be able to download it again, go on my SOE account, and possibly make a character and do some footage for you folks. So I'm pretty happy about that. It was seen that SOE had done a 180 and backed out of the deal with, with ProSyben. So that is excellent. While we're here on Landmark, I'll give you a quick look at what I've been up to. Uh, still on the, uh, the skull in the mountain. I've put some towers up and uh, like a fortress at the top. Uh, yesterday I put this stairwell from the uh, crafting area all the way up to where the living quarters are. A little bit of <laughs> furnishing, if you can call it like that. Yeah, I've got like a little dining room there, bedroom, storage. Up to the fortress, I suppose you could call it, at the top. We've got the towers I've been messing with. Let's see if we can get a view of this. So that's like the, the forge at the top of the mountain. I've now expanded it into two claims. Yep. Fall down, fall down, fall down. As you can see. I apologise if you can hear the clicking of the keyboard. It would appear the microphone on my headset is broken. I've tried to do this recording four times. 
and it started off fine every time and fade, my voice faded out to nothing. So for the time being, I'm afraid you'll have to put up with the uh, the clickety click of my Black Widow keyboard. <laughs> I'm sorry until I get a new uh, I'll get a new headset. I'll try and do that this weekend. All right, folks. I just really wanted to let you know that Old Grey is happy. And SOE, I thank you very much for doing what you've done and doing the 180 on Pro Cyber. Didn't, none of you players liked the move when you first did it, and I'm glad now it is being reverted. So thanks very much, folks. If you like the video, please leave me a like and subscribe if you haven't subscribed. It would be most beneficial. This is all grey. Signing off.